You're on a tear right now. I mean, like, undefeated except for a second at in Doha, but what's going right this season? Um, well, you know, for me, uh, I was just talking down here as well, you know, it's like, I'm, I'm getting my master's, I'm getting my doctorate in chiropractic at Life University, I'm wrapping that up, I feel like I've handled the stress for the last four years of, you know, balancing the doctorate and training at a high level, you know, and now that I'm, I'm coming down a little bit off that school stress and school load, I feel like the track's just picking up, and I'm, I'm just hauling. Brand new kid, the steel. I mean, like you told me, last, fairly last minute. This looks good too, huh? Yeah, yeah. This looks good. The spikes feel fast, and the spikes feel amazing. You know, this is my first time getting around 400 meters in them, so I can't say that I'm sad. Wait, so all right. So walk us through this. So you, you get the kit, the spikes, put on for the first time, probably for warm ups, and then this is it. Yeah, I got them. I, I, I had the full plate okay. uh, a couple days ago. You know, last week they sent it, just kind of see how you feel with the spikes. Um, then they sent this, and you know, I got a phone call from the front desk yesterday <laughs> and so we're bringing some boxes up and I was like oh started opening boxes I was like okay we're going nice so yeah all right so fourth last year what's it gonna take to break that top three um, probably faster than what I ran today, um, but I'm preparing for that. You know, everything that I'm doing is in preparation for U.S. Champs. Um, again, it's just about execution for me, you know, and being able to come out of these meets healthy and, you know, feeling like I'm executing well, but there's still a lot of work to do. You know, I, I still haven't been able to plug my stride pattern that way I want to this year, which for me is exciting, you know, to be in a position where I'm continually PRing and not necessarily executing the way that I would like to. So each time when you go to you know these diamond leagues, what are you learning when you go up against you know, Rai and, and some of these other international stars? Yeah, you know, I don't ever like, that's all back burner for me, you know? When I, when I go to a meet, I don't care if it's 30 degrees outside and pouring and snowing and it's just me running a solo race, I'm going for a PR. And I'm going, you know, I'm, I'm taking it hard, I'm taking it out hard and I'm not looking back, you know? So. Yeah, traveling to these meets is awesome. It's a great experience. I'm, I'm, I think I'm learning to enjoy that process and enjoy that travel and enjoy being in that atmosphere. But for me, again, it doesn't matter if I'm in LA. It doesn't matter if I'm in Doha, you know, halfway around the world. Like, I'm there to compete and I'm ready to execute. What's next? Uh, I'm going to FBK Games in Hengelo and then waiting to hear on Paris and then I'm confirmed for Oslo. Nice. Well, best of luck. Thank you so much. Wonderful.